double shot. May it keep you safe. Remember. Hope you've had your shots. Try not to die. time you're bleeding to death. Just think, Dr. Zed. on my outrunner now. to kill you, which is kind of weird. I need your help. Oh, I should have a name. Humans have names. I bet I'm malfunctioning like the dickens, so how about Mal? Hi, I'm a robot, and I don't like that. Could you help me become human? Maybe? I don't wear clothes, but I see humans wearing lots of clothes. Could you get me clothes from those bandit guys nearby? I'll wear so many clothes, I'll be the best human ever. 
I am human. I eat food and desire things. Once I am human, I will talk to you about things that are not so important. That building with the light shooting out of it? That's the info stockade. We're gonna get you there through the main Iridium pipeline. Head there now. Welcome to Dr. Zed's portable clinic. What can I get for you? There should be a ladder on the side of the pipe leading to a maintenance hatch. You can use that to get inside the pipeline. It'll be messy, but it'll lead you to the stockade. to raise the pressure till that pipe's fit to burst. Then you can bust the pipe, get into the stockade, and find out where the warrior's buried. Hey, buddy. It's me, Ronan. Let's kill Handsome Jack and then we'll all go out for milkshakes. 
No, I'm just playing. He's still really dead. Grabbed his echo unit you know, when I left. Just wanted to tell you that Lilith is doing a bang-up job charging the vault key for me. The warrior will be awake in no time. are nearly bursting. <laughs> Hit the last pumping station and we'll be ready to blast the pipeline open.
pressure in the pipeline so high, a little force will pop it like a blister. Get back to the pipeline and bring your vehicle. <laughs> I got an idea. through the pipeline now. Get inside and find out where Jack's got the warrior. Stockade. 
inside. Good news, everybody. I stole the drop barge. Hyperion was no match for my secret punch you in the face until you die fighting style. <laughs> when the time comes, we'll fight our way to the vault together. Thanks for accepting my job. I <laughs> my uncle Teddy and sent him to die on this armpit of a planet. I need you to search his cabin in the arid nexus for something I can use to avenge his death. You'll need to act. Never hurts to know. about the man you're killing while you're in the nexus grab whatever files you can on jack angel get this message to whomever's organizing the construction out in the nexus no matter what happens make sure that old bandit town uh, fire stone i think it's called make sure it stays standing that piss out little rest stop is where it all began oh and another thing i want it on company policy that instead of firestone we're changing its name to jackville Really twist the knife for those bandit bastards, you know what I mean? I, I want those vault hunting sons of bitches to see what I've done to this place. I want it to stand as a testament to their faith. They couldn't protect New Haven, they couldn't protect Firestone, and they're sure as hell not gonna protect Sanctuary. What a nice day. Just walking out in the sun, talking into my echo recorder. Hoping skags don't ambush me and break my gun into four separate parts before eating them. Oh god! That is exactly what is happening! To ah! Oof, skags ate they gun? No way to tell which one of the ugly things has it. Just start hunting skags and hope for the best. There's a hidden lever somewhere that'll get you into Teddy's basement. people on Pandora, evidently, kept all his echo correspondence. Find something that proves Hyperion stole his designs, so I can sue him into oblivion. <laughs> well, first day on Pandora. Wife's not too happy about the move, but I'm sure things will be all right. This here's the beginning of our new life. <laughs> Scar. Once I bury her with the lady finger, that cute little gun I made for her, I'll see if I can't get me some revenge. <laughs> you won't have died for nothing, Marion. I promise you that. It's 
Scar blinded me and ate my leg. <laughs> I may be a blind, crippled widower, but that don't mean all's lost. Met some folks looking for the vault. I did the see you later joke a couple times, but they just didn't get it. Oh, and I did find that old message I got from Hyperion a few years back. Hit it in the corner for safe keep. All oh, rack spit. Bandits. Well, I'm sure this will turn out all right. Mr. Baha, we at Hyperion adore your wave rifle design so much that we have decided to appropriate it for ourselves. Our assassins are en route to your home on Isolus. Between us, Mr. Baha, I would suggest leaving the solar system before they arrive. Great. That was just what I was hoping to hear. Now, if you can find the blueprints for the weapon design they ripped off, I'll give you the first gun my uncle ever gave me. Mercenary, should you return those sensitive documents to the Hyperion Corporation, we can offer more than what Mr. Baja's niece can pay. A fine Hyperion armament, for example. Don't listen to those corporate thieves. We both know my uncle deserves justice. And I'll throw in the first gun Uncle Teddy ever made for me. Nachos!
Receiving this, respond as soon as you can. Blake came back again today and showed me some faked pictures of New Haven. The city was burning. A lot of people were dead. Blake said his boss burned the place to the ground when everyone living there wouldn't move out. Of course, I know those pictures had to be faked because you and the rest of your pals were holed up in New Haven and you would have stopped those troops from taking the town, right?
not bad. Don't worry, baby. I'm Good care of you. Candidates today, Angel. There are four treasure hunters who arrived on a shuttle several hours ago. They are currently on a bus to Firestone. Great. Say this to them. Don't be alarmed. I need you to stay calm and don't let on that anyone is talking to you. Start making your way off the bus. The bus is still moving, sir. Shut up. Tell them. John, why have you dispatched one of our satellites to Pandora? What are you doing? But, but uh, sir, uh, the energy readings my uh, instruments uh, at home are getting from Pandora are... Get out of there at once, you hideous little code monkey, and shut off that satellite! Yes, sir. I'm sorry, Mr. Tassiter. It won't happen again, sir. for profit and power, too. Don't listen, Vault Hunter. He killed Angel long before you pulled the plug. Don't you dare speak about my daughter. <sighs> Lilith has quite the little mouth on her, doesn't she? And as it turns out, when that iridium is pumping through her body, I can stab her over and over and over, and it just heals right back up. I'm told it's agonizing. Oh, yes. Son of a bitch. We're coming, little. Just hold on. Robot! Cat
Hey, Roland. I appreciate your offer to move into Sanctuary, but I got a lot of stuff here in Firestone. Uh, Sanctuary sounds nice and all, but Firestone's my home. I made my decision. If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die in the city I was born. Firestone. Attention, citizen of Firestone. Die. Oh, piss. Uh, on second thought, Roland, uh, when's the soonest you can come pick me up? Got the money, I'll save your gold during life.
sent all the Iridium he's mine straight to the Hero's Pass. That must be where the warrior's buried. Get back to Sanctuary. It's time to get ready for the final assault. Assemble them for you.
Thank you for calling the Hyperion Suicide Prevention Hotline. Handsome Jack regrets to inform you that you are a coward. Enjoy your nothing, idiot! Okay, look, I need your help. I 
know what you're thinking. You're, yeah, trap, don't listen. But it's about my grandmother. I built her a cottage on the Iridium Blight Inn. I need you to check on her. Please make sure everything's okay. This isn't for me. This and Jack, Lilith, and the warrior are in Heroes Pass, so that's where we're... The 
This is the final <clears throat> fight, amigo. If you gotta prepare, do it now. Go check around the city. These people don't have much, but they still want to help you. Hyperion's locked the entrance to Hero's Pass. Get back to Claptrap. You'll need him to open the way for you. Brick and I will meet you once you're in. Win or lose, we're gonna finish this together. For Bloodwing! For Roland! For Pandora! talking about you. Now you, you make sure to come back alive, okay? If you can, come back with Jack's head on a pike. Haha, <laughs> you hear? What Scooter said? I would have hollow that some bitch's gourd and ate nachos out of it. Oh, nearly forgot. Ellie and I got something for you. Hope it helps. to kill you, which is kind of weird. I need your help. Oh, I should have a name. Humans have names. I bet I'm malfunctioning like the dick and so I know why I still don't feel human. I don't... Limbs. I hear those bandits have tons of limbs to spare. You could ask them for a few. Once I am human, I will talk to you about things that are of little... No importance. I will... politics because if we disagree you will not like me anymore
is it, Minion? Our vengeance is finally at hand! <laughs>